We're going in blind to this game of Prism Chapter 1 The Dark Unicorn. Hi Ewan, how's it going? Confused. Are you ready to get lost and not know where to go? I'm sure I am. Nice. Gotta say, not terrible animation. This not is probably where they spent all their budget. So, uh, interesting piece of trivia. Yes. This is chapter one. Oh. There is no further chapters. Oh. Yes. This is how well this game did. I have three copies of this game. How did you get three copies? I don't... So I bought this blind lot from Blockbuster. Okay. And it had 300 games. 300? Yes. Okay. And I have a lot of duplicates. Yeah. There were two copies of this game in it. Two copies. And I had previously bought one copy of it. Wow. Yeah. <gasps> Extras. <gasps> Movie gallery. Credits. Oh, yes. We just watched the prologue. Art gallery. Oh, my favorite art. Questionable. <laughs> uh, um, actually, that is a genre of art. Thank you very much. Uh, Killington. I was going to do crust with an R. K-R-U-S-T? No. How about crusts? Nice. Yeah, like that's good. That's a nice solid name. Are you sure you want this name, Crutz? Yeah. What happens if you put a swear word in there? Would it censor it? I doubt it. But then again, there are some games where they're like, yeah, we know what you typed in. Yeah. Don't do that. Animal Crossing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can still put swear words in for villagers' names and stuff. Their, their sayings. Oh, yeah. I remember hearing a story about a person who named their Animal Crossing town something like P or something, and they got so upset they smashed it with a hammer and then threw up out of sadness or something. They named it P, but it didn't go through? It did go through, and they got very upset or something like that. Why did they not just reset their island? They were a kid. That makes no sense. Like a kid with a DS chip, they name it something vulgar, and they're like, oh no! Smash oh, it. they panicked. Yeah, they panicked as soon as it saved it. Oh. Yeah. Oh, boy. That is terrifying. It's a Skyrim horse. It has eyes on the front of its head. Yeah, it's a predator. Yeah. Didn't we talk it, about this once? It eats meat. Um, no, we've read, read the same memes. Uh, okay. What is your favorite uh, fantasy trope? Um... <laughs> Can you frame that question a little bit better? Like, my favorite trope is a MacGuffin is the reason for the journey. Every time So, like, the ring for the Lord of the Rings? Yeah. Whoa, I can draw circles! I can go wah, 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 Well, if we're gonna do that, we should play the Harry Potter game. Wow, I can just ride around on a horse. Riding a horse all day. Dragons fly and breathe fire. That's the trope. That is a trope. That's three of them, dragons, flying in fire. Yeah. Ah. Uh, ogres turn to stone in daylight. Ooh. Hold L2 button. The, the cyclops with one eye. The giant cyclops, by the way. Ooh, yeah. Um, fairies that are invisible and or little light balls until they're like right in front of your face. Yeah, that's a weird one. Yeah. I don't get it. Well done. Uh. Do you read a lot of fantasy novels? Nope. No? No. Nonfiction? Nonfiction, but not fantasy. Uh, okay. I strictly read fiction. Strictly fiction. Get out of this world. Yeah, pretty much. Like, I live in the real world. I don't want to read about it. It's all sad and depressing. Wow, don't you just love mandatory tutorials? Mm -hmm. Are they just the best? They are so much fun. Wow. I do appreciate that the uh, the unicorn has a tail that is not animated like a tail would be. Yeah. Yep. It's just like a little uh, fluffy parasol. Magic. Use carrot staff to find and destroy hidden spheres. 
Hallow's Rear. Oh. It's not just a Pegasus, and it's not just a unicorn. It's a Pegalcorn. Yeah. That's just lazy writing. Couldn't get two horses. Nope. Has to be two and one. Oh, I might don't. Okay. Cool. One of the bullet points in the backs of uh, Prism Chapter 1 is journey through four vast and eerie lands. Each with four levels to explore. Wow, that's a lot of levels. Probably. Yeah. 16 levels. I can do math. Four times four. <laughs> I wish I could do math. <laughs> I'm the wizard, thank you very much. The wizard. What a movie. Did I make you watch that movie? Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. It's just a big old ad. Hey, it had a fairy with giant tits in it. Thank you. Oh, oh, are we thinking of the same movie? No, we're, we're not. We're thinking of other movies, but I've yeah. watched both of them. Yeah. I'm the, thinking about the old animated one. Yeah. And you're thinking about uh, the one where they have to go to California. California. Nice. Yeah, but I've watched both of those. I was thinking of, of Wizards. Wizards, yeah, that's the, wizard. the one. Oh, the big titty fairy. Yeah. Isn't that the <laughs> World War II imagery or whatever? Sure was. Yeah. There's a lot of weird trivia about it. Wish I knew it. Oh. Not worth my time to look up. No. No, there's a lot of it, though. Battle five gargantuan bosses. Five gargantuan? I can only handle little bosses. Wait, where am I going? Seisu, Temu, Kalm, Tiki Masala, or <laughs> Quinoa. Nice. All right. Go and chop Ooh, suey. the nymph marshes. Oh, nice. might might get a little glimpse of something, something there. I think we live here now. Okay. Yeah, I'm good with that. This is an angry looking pegacorn. Peggle. Peggle? Is this Peggle? I don't know what game we're playing anymore. Wait, is Peggle the, the video game by PopCap has a unicorn or a Pegasus? I think it's a Pegasus uh, or a Pegacorn. I keep. I, I know the trivia is that I'm saying Pegasus, but that's an actual character's name. It's not what a winged horse is called. Yeah. I'm aware of that. Don't correct me. It's fine. It's a shortcut. That's all it is. Wow, this is a long level. <laughs> Race to the finish line. Ready? Go! go! Yeah. Gotta go fast. Oh, no. <laughs> Break the targets. Board on the platform. Check your luggage. I want to play Smash Brothers now. <laughs> oh, I should bring it over. You got yourself a Switch. Shut up! Shut up! Don't be no crystal. Spoilers. Am I dead? I'm dead. Wow. What? Oh, you don't have a life, ha uh, life counter or health counter or anything. What am I here to do? Is this slamscape? I do have a health counter. It's just very small. Where is it? One of the jewels on the left hand or right hand side? Yes? Owie, stop it! Which one is it? Stop attacking me! I can't look in directions! Leave oh, me alone! Oh, your health comes back. It's the, uh, the blue on the left. I don't know how I died instantly, though. It hit you really hard. A lot. Uh-huh. Can you go in that? Is that water? Or, or grass? I don't know. I don't trust it. There was something diving in it. Some it's not like you have life total. Go for it. Oh, that hurts. That hurts a lot. Yeah, that's probably why you died. All right. What the hell is that? Ah, scary is what, what it is. What is any of this? Why does mud hurt you? <laughs> Get my feet dirty? Yuck. Okay, what am I supposed to be doing here? Am I supposed to be rescuing people? Turning people into stone? Shooting them? What do I do? Get to the end? Maybe... If that's the case, why would I fight anything? Ah! Leave me alone. Too bad you don't have a map. Or control over anything. 
Imagine if this is a rail shooter. Kind of is. Feels like it. I have very little control over my world. That's just life. Okay, do you destroy? Do I destroy you? Do it. No, nope, I die. Okay. Alright, I'm back here. Oh, that blue plant was a checkpoint. Interesting. Or just a hard end. Zap, 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 zap. Die. Hello. That was a person? Well, you wanna do something now? Bye. Enjoy <laughs> eating... I don't know. Unicorn farts? Eat hot laser. No. Eat hot laser, fool. Am I supposed to do something with my zappy? Yeah. <laughs> Good shot. Uh, have, you ever, uh, no. have you ever gone horseback riding? Yeah, when I was a little feller. Oh, uh, yeah? Ow! Ow! Stop it! So, like, nothing in the last ten years? No. Okay. Yeah, me neither. Are you offering? No! <laughs> Where am I gonna get a horse? Where am I gonna get a riding? <laughs> Don't answer that. Yeah. Mm. You died. Death. I don't know how I'm supposed to kill those things. It's like, okay, here's how you walk. And now you know why they never made a chapter two. Yeah. It's like, alright, here's the walking controls. Here's a bunch of magic. Alright, uh, kill God. Yeah. Come on, do it. <laughs> That's what Dark Souls 3 does. That's okay. That one's fair. No, it's not. It totally is. Here's your basic weapon. Kill the guardian. Yeah, Udix Gundir, he's a scrub. You parry him a couple times, he's dead. No. Susceptible to firebombs when he turns into a big squiggly monster man. But, but you don't get any. Sure you do. You can choose it as your starting gift. If you need it. You're awful. Nah, I just played That game is awful. awful. It's a great game. The controls ah! are awful. Hey! All the mechanics Help! are awful. Help! The level design is awful. The sound design is awful. Nah, the story it's a great is awful. Game. It has no redeeming qualities. It's a good game. No. Dark Souls, Demon Souls. Awful. Demon Souls just had a remake come out for the PS5. Yeah, and it's awful. It's not awful. Yeah. It's just a little trick. Oh, those hurt me? No, okay. that kills you. That kills me straight up. Good job. Oh Good my job. god, what is this game? Oh, here's a little charge. Is that my only other attack that doesn't use up all my mana? Oh yeah, and it also tells you your charge only does attacking at the very start. After that, you're screwed. Can you go back to the, uh, the map select? I might want to. Uh. Exit to map. Wow. They actually level. gave that option. It's like they knew. Mm hmm. Uh, Go for it. Gnome Hills. Gnome Hills? Yep. Yuck. What do you think of. I don't think. Actual difficulty in games oh. or artificial difficulty? Cause Give me an example. There are some games where the difficulty comes from you dealing less damage or. If they just tack on a bunch of enemies, or if it's like something you have to think through and think before you do. What I hate are boss rushes. Yes, that is artificial difficulty. It's yeah. like, yeah, you understand how the boss works. Or, You've done it before. Now do it with limited resources. Yeah, but back to back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or uh, where they give you the same bosses before, but just more health. Yeah. That sucks too. It's just lazy. <laughs> Same, same mechanics, same model, you know, same arena, more health. Now imagine if in a game, instead of doing that, they put something similar in front of you, but it's got a completely different uh, set of attacks it'll pull off. Would that be better? So it uh, Can you subverts give your expectations. An example of a game that does that? Dark Souls 3. Oh. <laughs> that first boss, he shows up later as a much stronger boss. With a different move set that uh, so it's just lazy. subverts your expectations. So lazy. instead of lazy. doing like a swing of a weapon, See, we call it'll that, do a kick in the opposite recycling. direction. 
That's when they use an asset. No, 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 a it's a different wig. asset. Yeah, no. Similar, but different. No. It's just the... <laughs> okay, sometimes. But changing the move set is a good way to change it up, right? Instead of just, here's a bunch of enemies at once. No, what, what's really terrible is they take the same character, but just make it go a little bit faster and give Ooh. it a really strong melee attack so it rushes you. Oh, yeah, yeah like just a change of AI even. Mm. Just really aggressive AI. No, I'm trying to think of a game that does that. Um, Other than Mega Man. <laughs> Mega Man. It's also guilty of doing boss, rush, boss rushes. Yeah. Oh yeah, very much so. Isn't that what the game is? That was just a big boss rush? Yeah, it's With like, a little bit of platforming in the middle? Here's some platforming, try it out, <laughs> figure it out. Then you get to do the actual challenge. Are we just going to grief every game now? I don't know. How will we, how we do? We just talk trash about video games? As and we play video games? Talk trivia about video games. Yeah, and do trivia. Yeah, okay. Yeah. What is your least favorite collectible thing to get in the level? Um, like, Tony Hawk had, like, tapes and movie reels and stuff to unlock extra bonus content. I'm sure if you were really into that sort of stuff, it would be great. Or like, uh, all this, the new South Park games have uh, Pokemon to collect. I don't like collectibles <laughs> where you only get a reward after you collect all of them, and by the time you get them all, you're done the game. You're not playing it ever again. Yeah, Saints Row 3 does that. Yeah. It's like... And they were mandatory. And if you didn't know that, there's like a lot of backtracking to do. Like, it's kind of antiquated, the whole idea of collectibles and stuff. Uh, what else? The the Chaos Emeralds from all the Sonic the Hedgehog games. Where you first have to collect 50 rings, and then you have to do the puzzle to collect the gems, and then you have to get 7 gems. Isn't that all just for like a teeny tiny bit extra at the very end? No, it's so you can turn into Supersonic, but it's really difficult to use. Oh, okay. It's actually worse and slower, because it's hard to control. Um, what else? Yeah, I... Sly Cooper had uh, keys to collect, and it had like pieces of map to collect in bottles. Mm. That was annoying. I know that the Assassin's Creed games were big culprits of collectibles to the point where it takes you the entire game to get them all plus extra and then you have to backtrack in case you miss them yeah and they'd have glitches where oh as soon as you collect number 99 out of 100 you can't get that 100 one to show up on the map it just disappears off oh yeah that's Stuff nice like that them. and then once you collect everything what's the point of having that super reward these days in games, as soon as you beat a game, you're like, alright, done. Go play something else. There's hundreds, thousands of games. I can understand if it was your only game. Oh, from Mr. Call of Duty over here, Mr. I don't Rainbow that. Siege 6. Rainbow Six Siege I play because I got buddies <laughs> who play it. Uh-huh. Yeah. How many hundreds of hours have you put into that game? Uh, you like know how many other games two, there are? Like 200. Uh-huh. Yeah. I've been playing through Hollow Knight. Oh, have you? Yeah. It's kind of neat. It's pretty. Not a fan. No? No. I hate platformers like that. Uh, okay. It's just a tricky platformer. Uh, Destiny 2 is guilty of that too. They have unnecessary platforming <laughs> in a game that shouldn't have platforming. Nope. Especially when there's like a couple platforms that require like the most precise jumps you can get where landing it is like the third jump on a triple jump. Oh, a lot of their raids are bad for that. Yeah. It's like, oh, if you want to get the secret, really good stuff that you actually want out of the raid, you got to do platforming challenges and, and coordinated if you die, puzzles. It fails it for everyone, and they get mad. Yeah. I used to actually do a bunch of D two raids because, well, everyone else was playing it, <laughs> so, and it was free for a little while. What's your biggest gripe for video games? Biggest gripe? Um, Mine is uh, subscriptions for online services. Oh, that's never fun. For example, if you want to like trade Pokemon in in the new Pokemon games, you, you either got to be in person. Pass for it now. 
Yeah, you gotta either be in person or you pay for the online. Microsoft screwed that for everyone, though. They really did. Subscription services? Yeah. For their. Because wasn't it. Uh, servers? And then they shut down the servers. PlayStation originally didn't do that for what, PS3 or. P uh, PS2. Oh, really? Yeah, I even have a PS2 modem. If I if the server still existed, I could play Tony Hawk Underground online. And huh. I did it once before they shut down the servers. Huh. It wasn't great because they had to decrease the draw distance. So it gave you, like, a really bad black fog of war. Uh, yeah, yeah. It made it hard. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't like paying for the online, but now they're trying to boost subscriptions via giving out quote-unquote free stuff with limited it. Limited deals. Oh, yeah, deals as well. Because mm. I know what, what they Microsoft want to do, has Game Pass. What they're trying to do is make you build up a uh, collection or an archive of video games. So if you stop your subscription, you lose your collection. Oh, okay. In yeah. the inverse of that, I have a Steam account which has a couple hundred ish games on there let's say and I don't lose access to it unless I lose my account yeah I don't have to pay for anything else other than the games hmm. people who are on like the Google service have to pay for a subscription and the game yeah and if you cancel your subscription you lose your game that's complete BS yeah <laughs> yeah or, Stadia was just a hot mess or if you get banned from YouTube by the way, you also lose your all your video games because they're all tied to the same account now. Really? Yes. No way. <laughs> that is insidious as heck. Mm -hmm. Being able to take something away from people... Because they're all tied together now. So if you want to close your Google account, you lose like your Google documents and your Gmail and your YouTube account. Oh my god. <laughs> you lose your... All the games you bought, you lose your um, your Android accounts, all your your purchases that you've bought on your phone. You Jeez. lose your YouTube Music account. YouTube Music, awful. It's a joke. I tried it. It's god awful. I tried listening to one song. The first thing it does redirect me to a different song. They're like, you might like this one instead. Like, no, I looked up this song because I wanted to listen to it. No, you're you're gonna like this one. They probably didn't have it, is what it was. No, they had it. It's just a YouTube video <laughs> that I clicked on. It offered it up. Clicked on it. It's like, you might like this instead. I'm like, no, I'm deleting you now, right now. Bad review. Done. Wow. <laughs> I'm having none of that. I only found out that YouTube music was a thing yesterday. Really? Yeah, recently. Because they, they turned on... Uh, 15 second mandatory ads yeah they did so that's how I became aware that there was YouTube music because people yeah. were complaining about ads I actually stopped using uh... do, you, do you remember back in the day when Google's whole like company motto was don't be evil whatever yeah. happened to that now their motto is be evil but don't let people find out No, be evil and show ads about it <laughs> look how evil we are you think we were evil before? <laughs> Wait until next week. We're going to shut down this service. <sighs> I missed Google Hangouts. <laughs> Google Hangouts. Yeah. Uh, it's that's... gone. That's an oldie. <laughs> it's kind of like I miss MSN Messenger. I miss Skype before Microsoft bought it. Skype was kind of a good thing. Yeah, until Microsoft bought it and then they ruined it. And now it's only for businesses. <laughs> Because mm -hmm. it's not useful for anyone else. I like how companies also bump up their uh, download rate by pre-installing stuff. Like, oh. Like Microsoft is doing with Clash of Clans? Yeah. Like, we got so many players. We're so awesome. Like, yeah, but you made a deal with this company, so it's pre-installed on all their hardware. Like Facebook does with all the iPads and iPhones? They do it with friggin' uh, Android, too. Uh, Twitter does it, too. Except I can't delete Facebook. It's one of the pre-installed ones, and it will not let me get rid of it. Um, and it takes up so much space. There is a way to do it, but I don't know how, because I don't have an Android phone. Yeah. I don't have a phone. 
You don't <laughs> need a phone. Nope. Too cheap. I don't know how to fight these things. But you know what's good about not having a phone? What's that? They can't do that, uh, the, uh, um, the, the, the swap attack, the, uh, what's it called? Come on, brain, you could do this. Come on. Uh, sim swap attack. What's that? It's where they, they spoof your sim card and they steal your phone number and then use your phone number as a, a second authentication device. Oh. So they can receive your SMS messages. Oh. Yeah, sim swapping. That is sketchy. So because I have a home phone line, I can't get sim swapped. Yeah. So if they want to use that as, if I want to use that as a two factor, I have to be physically at my home. Mm -hmm. I don't like that a lot of things now require a cell phone. Like a um, Steam two factor. Any two factor. Like, Steam's only two factor requires a, a cell phone. I don't like <laughs> having to give out my number. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. Like, but on, but on the other hand, I don't have a cell phone, so people can't contact me at all hours of the day and night, wherever mm -hmm. I am. Mm -hmm. Which is kind of nice. You know, if I don't want to answer my phone, I could just leave <laughs> or turn my my phone off. Yes. Yeah. But what if I want to surf the internet? I've got a tablet. You know how what many if places I want to do that in public? Why would I? Oh. Uh, this game's really bad. Well, yeah, that's why they never made Chapter 2. Nah, I don't think that's why. Oh. I think it's because everybody was too busy looking at the fairy in the intro. Does it have any redeeming qualities whatsoever? Not really. It controls like trash. I don't know how to fight stuff, nor does it give you any inclination that you're doing damage to things. So now whenever I get to one of the big bossy things, I just use all the strongest spell over and over and over till it's dead. I also don't like that the maps are too big and there's no indication of where to go. Yeah. Like. There's no like actual overview map? No. There's no radar? All I do is I get close to these things, charge up the ice attack and keep using it. Why is ice blue? I don't know. Or purple. Because he's magic ice. Oh, that makes sense. Also, anything that has vines on it will hurt you. Well, because vines are evil. Duh, that's why they have spines on them. It's obvious. Mm -hmm. Speaking of shitty tropes. We're losing our shield! Don't We're losing our shield, oh no. That. We died. Oh, you had a shield? I guess. Is that your health? I guess my health is my shield. Oh. I don't understand it. Hooray, I'm already here. Shortcut. Took like nice. a ton of damage from it. But I'm here. How do you think my back also, I don't know how to get my stuff back as soon as it's gone except for destroying these things. But as soon as they start spitting out gunky gooey stuff. Maybe it's when you're out of combat? To come back? Maybe? Yeah, because your health's not refilling like it, like it used to. Uh, magic. Wow, I have no magic left. We're in big trouble. Oh, something. wouldn't it be an annoying if there was a button you had to hold? Like uh, a, a focus funny. mind button? Yeah. Wow, what if I just run away? Because I played a game like that. Did you? Yeah. You had infinite magic, but you always had to ref stop and refill it. Oh, there. Yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah. that's stupid. I hate it. I hate it so much. <laughs> Called it. Okay, how am I supposed to kill you? I really hope your health doesn't refill when I walk away. So I'm just going to keep doing this. Too bad there's no health bar for it. Like an indicator of some sort. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Uh -huh. You know, I'm like every other game smack, does. Smack, 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 smack. Oh, I'm dying. Like quality of life? No. No. Quality of death improvement? Wow, I can run fast. Gotta go fast. Whoa, gotta go fast. Way past fast. 
way past overdue. <laughs> God, die, please, and thank you. Die, what even is please, that? And thank you. Is it like a spider? Know. It's something. Is it a plant? Is that it? Was scissor hands trying to fight you or something? Like what is that? I have no idea. This attack is also inconsistent as hell. Sometimes it just releases behind you. What is that tiny person doing? Oh, I saved him. He was a monster. Now he's not. Oh, yeah. This is a bad game. Yeah. That's why we're playing it. Yeah, I guess. You're welcome. Whoa, look, I can go so fast. Wow. Oh, and he's back. So I have to do this all in one go. Keep good, scrub. Wow, 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 wow. Look, I waggle my finger. You're dead now. <laughs> Zap. Okay, do I have to kill you now? Oh, I bet you they like are like, sh like shield guardians, and you have to take them down to get rid of the guy's shield. Oh, probably. Yeah. I don't know how I'm getting hurt right here. There's a dude off screen. Uh, he's behind you to the right. Yeah, shooting. He's shooting minions. Okay, freaking sniped, bro. So are we done? I think we're done. So uh, say goodbye to Prism. Yeah. It's going on the shelf forever and ever. I don't think there's any other playthroughs of this. Oh, definitely. If, if there are, I feel bad for them. <laughs> I pity you, and I'm sorry. Blame, yeah. blame TDK Software. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, yeah. TDK Media Active. Not Media or Interactive. Media oh. Active. Well, time to press X and continue on real life and say bye-bye to this game. Goodbye, game. Goodbye. You don't want to play anymore? You're done? I'm done. Aww. Ugh. What a shame. We should put the memory card in this case, so I'll never be able to find it. <laughs>